he was one of those guys that, that the players really loved. A Bay Area high school dealing with a tragic loss tonight after a student athlete died in a car crash over the weekend. There is a growing roadside memorial for 16 year old Kevin Gallardo in Lakewood Ranch. That's where our Sarasota Manatee Bureau reporter Allison Henning joins us now live. Allison. Jen, Josh, good evening to you both. People have been stopping by throughout the day today, dropping off stuffed animals and fresh flowers. If you take a look behind me, you can see there's a pretty large group gathered out in front of that makeshift memorial right now. Gallardo was dearly loved at Sarasota High School. His baseball coach tells us today was a tough one for everyone on campus. 16-year-old Kevin Gallardo was a son, brother, friend, and teammate. He was number 13 on the baseball field, a Sarasota sailor. Head coach Clyde Metcalf tells Eight on Your Side, Gallardo was a talented pitcher who was loved on and off the field. He was a great kid. He was very personable. Um, tremendous manners, raised really well by his parents, and he was very well liked. On the side of University Parkway in Lakewood Ranch, there's a wooden cross and dozens of fresh flowers in memory of the student athlete. He was killed in a crash here Friday night. The 17 year old driver and two teens ejected from the back seat survived. Troopers say speed was a factor. This is a tragedy that, that, that didn't have to happen. Coach Metcalf met with his team over the weekend to lend support during this difficult time and to send a powerful message. And asked them to, you know, to, to keep this moment in their heart, to try to just be careful and, to, and think about the consequences of their actions. It must be a learning experience. You know, if a tragedy like this can save other lives, you know, maybe it's not a complete loss. And Coach Metcalf says the baseball team is going to be planning something special in Gallardo's memory. Meantime, the crash investigation here still ongoing. Troopers say any possible criminal charges at this point are still pending. Live in Lakewood Ranch, Allison Henning, 8 on your side.